what's good. All right, before we get started, I want to wish everybody a happy 4th out there. Stay safe. Uh, drink responsibly, but just have fun. So stay safe, everybody. All right, so we finally got the results in from our first ever nominees for the Legends Hall of Fame. Uh, as you guys know, I'm going to start this whole new Hall of Fame thing where I'll put four figures up versus each other, and you guys decide who makes it into the Hall of Fame. The other two, well, we'll see what happens next year. So as you can see, the winners are Sentinel and Deadpool. Uh, Sentinel took the top spot by one point, so you know, it was real close all the way through. Iron Man didn't favor so well, but everybody else was real close. These two were in one point of each other, so got to thank everybody who uh, contribute, put their vote in. So, I mean, this is cool because um, this is what the community chose um, for Hall of Fame. So, I can't argue with any of these, you know what I'm saying, because Deadpool's just... He's almost a perfect action figure in a way. I mean, he's really dope. Comes with so many accessories. Just a fun figure to have. Um, really super hard figure to come by nowadays. So um, if you got him, consider yourself one of the elites because, yeah, he's a hard figure to come by. Sentinel is just an impressive all-around build-a-figure. Um, you can't go wrong having him in your collection. So once again, Sentinel and um, Deadpool take our first ever Hall of Fame. Uh, Juggernaut and Iron Man, you got to wait till next year. Sorry, guys. So let me guys let me know if you guys want to um, add um, the classics in here as well, like the X Men classic or Spider Man classics. So some of these guys are truly sick. So if you want to add those in with the Legends or just keep it just Legends, um, it's, it's all good to me. Just let me guys let me know what you guys want. All right, peace.